if you ask me the i think the comment which i mean wasn't made by me personally but was i think made by a spokesperson if i understand it right uh, was that comment correct my answer to you would be yes Mr. Jay Shankar, thank you for um, your time here with me. I'm Akshaya Kumar with Human Rights Watch, and I had a question about Manipur, in particular. Your, we want to know what your government is doing to address the divisive politics that's leading to attacks on minorities there. You have said that the comments from 18 independent UN experts who expressed concerns about Manipur were presumptive and misleading. Uh, however, It took three months before Prime Minister Modi spoke out on the issue. So instead of acknowledging that entire communities have been devastated, isn't it wrong that local officials, including the Home Minister and the Chief Minister of Manipur, are blaming the violence on infiltrators? Uh, what is the way the center will take forward this issue at this time? Uh, so you're giving me a question or an answer or both? Uh, so. Uh, the- The question is, uh, UN experts have been dismissed by you as being presumptive uh, and not providing the correct information about Manipur. But isn't it the case that uh, local officials have not responded adequately? And in fact, even the prime minister took three months before speaking out on the rape and parading of women uh, in okay. Manipur. So, so let me, if you ask me, uh, uh the i think the comment which i mean wasn't made by me personally but was i think made by a spokesperson if i understand it right uh, was that comment correct my answer to you would be yes uh if you ask me uh you know what is happening today in manipur i think one uh, you know one part of the problem in manipur has been the destabilizing impact uh, of uh Uh, uh of uh, migrants who have come that's one aspect of it uh, but there are also tensions which uh, obviously have a long history which uh, precede that uh, and uh, today i think the effort is on the part of the state government and the union government uh, to find a way by which uh, you know a sense of normalcy returns that arms which were seized during that period are recovered Uh, that there is an adequate law and order uh, uh, enforcement out there uh, so that incidents of violence uh, don't happen. Mm-hmm.